You may have been told it is necessary to rescan your TV for local antenna channels due to the FCC mandate that many local broadcasters need to change their frequencies. If you haven't yet made the move to local TV channels, this isn't that big of a deal. For you, this is the first time you'll be programming your TV to receive local broadcast channels. For those of you who have been receiving over-the-air TV, you will have noticed you are probably missing some channels. Not all broadcasters had to move to new frequencies, but those who were required to do so have a window from the fall of 2018 to the spring of 2020 to do so. Our local channels made the move in October 2019. To find out when your local channels are scheduled to change frequencies and which channels will be changing frequencies, go to the link in the description. Once there, just enter your zip code for more detailed information. The change in frequency has been mandated by the FCC to make room for mobile data. Apparently there is a growing demand for cellular data, but no place to put it, so the FCC decided the TV stations needed to make a move. The question that arises, why didn't the FCC just assign those frequencies to the mobile carriers instead and leave the TV stations alone? There are six digital broadcasters in this area offering 27 channels. After several channels went missing, we rescanned for channels. 15 came in right away, but it turns out they didn't need to change their frequencies, so they were always there and had been since they went digital. One of the broadcasters, which has three channels, that didn't come in posted in their website they were using a temporary and less powerful antenna but we're in the process of installing a bigger and better antenna and should be back to normal within another month. Wonder why they didn't install the new antenna before the changeover. They knew it was coming. The other broadcaster, with nine channels, did not have any notice on their website, didn't answer the phone, and emails bounced back with a message that the mailbox was full. After a week of scanning once a day, they finally came in. It's obvious the frequency changeover didn't go as smoothly as hoped. If your local channels haven't changed the frequencies yet, be prepared for some frustrations.